I'm asking people their biggest regrets, from those with zero responsibilities and life experience to some who have been alive for over a century. I got but first, what does a one-year-old regret? What's your biggest regret? Oh, he's taking up the mic for this one. What's your biggest regret? I didn't mean to come off that strong. Do you wish you didn't pee on the floor? I haven't went here in a while. Um, I don't know. Uh, I'm not sure. Well, at school I didn't do a funny joke. There's chickens that I threw a rock at one. You threw a rock at a chicken? <laughs> at school too. You're on demon mode. I am seven years old and my biggest regret is uh not listening to my mom. Yeah, okay. You gotta have something. No regrets. No regrets. <laughs> nice. Probably existing. I don't want to be here. Ages 1 to 10 were actually kind of concerning, but now the next ages are going to school and may learn and face more consequences to their actions. One time I yelled at my mom and she didn't talk to me for a very long time. I think I wasted too much money on some games. Going on zero gravity in a day. Why? Because my head feels like it's going to pop off. I don't have <laughs> I have a lot, but I, I don't know if I remember all of it. Caring what other people think. Biggest regret? Not going to private school uh, is sooner. I guess it's like the academics were like so much better than the kids that I get to hang out with now. I'm very blessed to hang out with the kids that I hang out with, so. I'm moving Three. here. I don't know. I've let a lot of people, like, walk over me and just, like, just being too, like, shy and just not, like, expressing myself enough, I guess. Yeah. Uh, not doing as well in middle school. Getting back with my ex when I was, like, 17 years old. What do you do? Um, they, like, basically cheated on me. Despite being teenagers, the answers have gone a little more serious, but what regrets could result from what some call the best time of a person's life? What's your biggest regret? Not researching the college I went to school. I didn't like look at the Reddit. Not having the confidence to do the things I wanted to do, like holding yourself back, because I feel like you could do so much more, but you're like, ah, I'm so anxious and scared. Uh, biggest regret? I don't know, probably crashing my car into the side of a highway. Okay. Biggest regret, downloading Tinder. I met a guy on there and he really f***ed me up. Getting to that age, you know? Yeah. We'll say not finishing college. <laughs> okay. How long did you go there for? Uh, like two years. Two years ago? Why'd yeah. you leave? Uh, cause, uh, I had a offense offense and I lost yeah. all my financial aid. I would have to say not speaking up for myself. I very much was a pushover for a lot of my life and it just kind of got me in a lot of situations that I didn't want to be in. Not taking a leap of faith when I wanted to. My biggest regret is not coming to America sooner. I don't think I have one because I learned from everything that I went through. And after the dust settles and you reflect, you're like, it was important I went through that. My biggest regret? Dyeing my hair red. Well, I guess the fun is over now, but let's see what people in their 30s regrets now entering a life of independence and responsibility. I mean, if I was choosing a career path again, I would probably choose something if I should have been writing earlier. Biggest regret? Not having him sooner. Maybe not finishing college. Why do you leave? I had a baby. What's your biggest regret? Uh... <laughs> uh, drinking too much. <laughs> no regrets tattooed on me. Oh my god! <laughs> no! I don't regret anything, actually. Being afraid of stuff. You're like afraid to make changes right. in your life. Not finishing school early. What's your biggest regret? Uh, no one. None. No regrets? No, no. Yeah, that everything works? been a lesson thus far. Yeah. You know what I mean? I gotta live through it. Even though there have been some prominent regrets so far, once you enter your 40s, you become at risk of a midlife crisis. I don't think I can say that on video. <laughs> um, having kids. What? <laughs> Doing too many drugs. Oh, sh <laughs> That scared me. <laughs> Doing too many. There's many. Oh, many? Yeah, yeah. Too many to just name one? <laughs> probably. Stay yeah. young, guys. Uh, probably the way I raised kids early on. Whoa. Not, not moving in love earlier in my life. Moving out of fear more than moving out of love. Right, so you wish you had just done the things you are passionate about? But just moving in love, period. You know what I'm saying? I wish I would have done that more than anything. Because uh, I was living in fear and it caused me to make a lot of bad decisions in my life and perceive things in a different way than I would if I was moving out of love. You know, life is short and um, there's people in our lives. You know, you wanna let the small things go and just continue to forgive and love. Not getting into working for nonprofit earlier. I worked in television for 15 years right? and uh, never felt good about it. I didn't have regrets. Not living in New York City long enough. My biggest regret was not going overseas when I was in college. Not moving abroad for my master's degree. By now, your earlier life decisions would have led you to your life at 50, which was starting to get me some much more deep answers. My biggest regret was not dating. I never got married and I got beautiful children, but it's like you can make children and not be produced. Doing your not taking my time. I rushed through high school, I rushed through college. I'm a news journalist, so I rushed into a career. I would have taken it a little slower, taken my time. After college, I would have traveled Europe for a year and then started my career. What's your biggest regret? 
uh, this interview. How old are you? It's too late, Meg. Not joining the NBA. Not joining the NBA. Were you good at basketball? I'm 6'7". What do you think? <laughs> I had a beer or alcohol before the interview I failed. Oh, oh so like a, a job interview. Yeah, job interview. Oh, yeah, job interview. hey, you learn from it. I don't have any regrets at the moment. I don't know if I have a regret. Not traveling around the world earlier in life. Well, I should have maybe stayed in college when I was in, but I'm made up for it. What do you do to make up for it? Uh, I became an investor. Got any investments that you... Uh, out of the ashes rises the phoenix. Okay, yeah. so buy the dip. After possibly partying, working, and caring for children for the last 60 years, most people will have retired and now have a lot of time to think about their past life choices and decisions. Dealing with the wrong people and getting out, like when you feel like you should get out, but you don't because you think that it'll change. Like a relationship, you mean? Yeah, a relationship. Not painting because I had to raise kids. No, I didn't go to university. Oh. Okay. I would have, I should have. My biggest regret is that my mother, when I applied for university, checked the box accountant instead of architect. My okay. biggest regret that how it's going to be your future. Oh, okay. So you think I'm going to get into trouble? Well, or I just hope, our generation? I hope not. Don't worry about me. Study something that would have given me a bigger opportunity in life. I was seeing David Bowie in Berlin in 1977. I don't have regrets. I don't have any regrets. 69. Not spending more time with the kids when they were growing up. Now at 70 years old, most people's path has been set. Anything they could have done, they likely can't do anymore, which could lead to some strong reflections. 70. What's your biggest regret? Oh, I didn't do a lot of things while I was young. Anything specific? He didn't become a billionaire. Yeah, that's oh. one of them, right? <laughs> I don't have any. Is I would change some of the ways that I raised my kids. This is only my third time in New York. None. Not doing more crazy things when I was younger. I did crazy things, but not enough. And you're not doing as much crazy things nowadays? You don't have the energy. <laughs> what, what, what age do you think you start stop feeling that energy at? 75. 75? <laughs> that's right. Just like, hits you like a wall. It, you hit it exactly. I'm almost there. Uh, I didn't take better care of my teeth. I have things that I regret, but then I forgave them. So I don't feel like I have things to regret. I have to say, I don't have regrets. I, I see them as learning experiences. <laughs> right. Uh, that I did not become a teacher. Now, beating the average life expectancy, what would someone who's been alive for 80 years do differently or regret from their entire life? I look back and things look much sweeter than they did then. I don't want to regret. I don't want to feel bad about all the bad things I did. I regret not having children. Right. Was there a reason you didn't have them at the I time? Didn't or? get married. The biggest regret is that I couldn't play shortstop for the New York. Yankees. That I didn't travel. I have none. None? None. I was an officer in the Marine Corps. That was really a, a wonderful experience and I finished up after my three-year commitment. I should have stayed in. I can't really think of what it might be. Yeah, I think when you're younger, you know, you expect a lot more from yourself. You're more critical of yourself. I think as you get older, you kind of take it easier on yourself. I don't have one. I don't really have anything that I regret. That would be mine. Despite living for almost a century, most people started to become more content with the decisions they've made, and I was more than curious to hear the biggest regrets from the small few living over 90 years old. I'm sorry I got married so young, got married at 18. That was a big regret. So right. got divorced and had two children <laughs> to raise right. by myself. My biggest regret, I guess, would be when I went to college and I didn't pay attention. Uh, my biggest regrets were probably because I didn't explain to the children about my life until they got older. Not really. Life is not easy. Life is what you make it. What's your biggest regret? <laughs> Takes a lot of thought because I don't think I have one. Yeah, I don't think I would either. Now that I think about it, choose what you want to do and work appropriately to get it. And you'll have no regrets that way. Almost everyone with the most life experience said they had the least regrets, an outcome I never expected. I can't think of anything right now. Biggest regret is not continuing my education. I went as far as high school. I can't think of anything right now that I say, oh, I wish I had done and I had never done. No regrets. I got no regrets. No regrets? I got no no regrets whatsoever. My greatest responsibility right now is to be a good example of faith. Help them whenever you can. Always be truthful and honest, and, and you'll never have any regrets.